Thank you for tuning in. I hope you're safe and well. Woody we'll here, and today we're going to be looking at the Why So Sad Nike SB collaboration. So this is a pair I have been looking forward to and I'm so happy to have picked these up. I managed to purchase these for retail. I think they're about 75 pounds from Flatspot and I actually hit on the, the raffle uh, with Flatspot for this pair and I'm so happy. It was a pair I was gonna get by hook or by crook um, and I'm just happy to get it for retail from such a great provider. Flatspot always does amazing work. I know I always shout them out, it's because they're brilliant in the, at the end of the day. Great images, great delivery, great service, great customer care, and yeah, all good. But I will have to definitely say as well an honorable mention to Focus Skate Shop in Scotland because uh, I managed to hit on their raffle as well for another size from my friend. And um, they've also done a sort of like collaborative tea, which their like money from it goes towards a mental health charity in Scotland. And they've done it with uh, John Horner, who also was the designer for the predatory bird for the Why So Sad. So absolutely amazing work. Uh, I can't wait to get that t-shirt through. Uh, I was hoping that I'd try and like film when I had it, but I'm gonna do an image so you can see, and I will leave so many links down below of everything I talk about in this video. So, to the shoe. I'm gonna break down the shoes and then try and be talking as well about uh, why so sad a little bit. Um, but yeah, let's start off with the Bruins. So I'd never had a pair of Bruins before. Uh, when I first saw these online, I thought that it was a blazer. But as I said, I wanted to get everything in connection to this collaboration. And I actually really like them in hand. They are a women's release. They only got up to UK 9.5, which is a US 10.5. I got the largest size, but I probably could have got a true to size and it would have been fine. Um, but I went for the safe bet and yeah, they're really nice. Never had a Bruin before. I've seen the lows, they are nice, but yeah, nothing's ever drawn me to purchase them before apart from the Why So Sad collaboration. So really nice brown around. They've got uh, mainly, it's mainly like, um, uh, suede, almost like a, a new buck here as well on these side panels to the back, but you've got like suede panels, some are hairier, some are not as hairy, but it feels like quite a nice material and it's a nice color as well. On that back hill, you've got the predatory bird. On the right, you've got the, um, the predatory bird on a bicycle and on the left, you've got it on a skateboard. Uh, above that, you've got on the hill tabs, a little question mark that also goes with the why so sad. You've got these light blue swooshes that I think still do their thing where you can remove the top layer and it reveals that really nice yellow that would go so well with these nice bright flat yellow laces that also have the question mark tips. If you wanna play it more low key, you can have the brown laces and inside you have the predatory bird on the right insole and then the why so sad in collaboration with Nike SB on the left insole. Insoles are the same in both pairs apart from the Nike SB Dunks are blue and then the Bruins it is like a brown color to match the shoe. You've got your um, gum sole as well on these Bruins and yeah I think all around it's actually really really nice and it's always nice to have um, something that draws you to a silhouette that you've never actually picked up before. I like the slim line, the like slim silhouette and yeah all good and obviously oh I forgot to mention it states why so sad at the back of the tongue tag. Um, these are both a purple box release. So the Bruins came in a purple box as well and it states women's Nike SB Bruin High Premium WSS, so why so sad? And it's light chocolate, light blue. So both of the boxes, uh, and this is where Nike SB have done a great job at really trying to spread the message. They've got these little like scannable QR code sort of type stickers on it. And when you scan it, it goes to the Nike SB website and it has a whole rundown about uh, Why So Sad and uh, John Rattree and a little bit about Ben Ramers and stuff like that. So it's really good to sort of educate yourself on everything via the Nike SB website. But I will also be leaving Why So Sad, which I think is like the predatory bird uh, website down below, which is worth checking out because you can purchase t-shirts and um, money from the t-shirts goes towards mental health and suicide awareness charities. Um, really cool designs. Uh, I think he, uh, John's doing absolutely amazing work. Um, he's had bouts of depression on and off and unfortunately he lost his uh, sister to suicide. I think that was in 2011 and they started um, 
Why So Sad in 2017. And they do a yearly thing of basically riding their bikes to different skate spots and skating them. And it's obviously about community and just having like an activity and just enjoying something you loved in a positive way. And that is obviously what the predatory birds represent on the little logos on both shoes. So it all ties in really well. It's all subtle, but it has so much meaning. And that is why both pairs are fantastic. But to the dunks. Now, these are absolutely beautiful. So, even if this wasn't a collaboration with Why So Sad, I think like you would look at these and be like, that is an absolutely beautiful colorway. Um, but the fact that it is with Why So Sad makes these top tier, in my opinion. Um, we'll do a little breakdown of the shoe. So, starting off with the bottom, Icy Outer Soul. So, always looks really nice straight off the bat but the, obviously with icy soles you can get that sort of wear and tear and dirt and it does sort of discolor quite quickly now i think it's interesting that they've done this on this release i feel like it's almost like showing your journey or your progression or your steps throughout wearing so i feel like it actually works really well with this collaboration then you've got that bright uh, nike sb shield in red uh white midsole and then to your upper where you've got these lovely blues uh, a blue suede um, around the toe box and around the back and stuff like that with this contrasting lighter blue stitching and then on the rest of the panels you've got this lighter blue nubuck and i think that yeah, it all works really really well really dark navy on the swooshes and actually again these swooshes you can remove the outer paint to reveal this uh, bright yellow underneath and i've seen a few people remove the yellow underneath mainly on the inner swooshes and i think it looks really cool and i've seen people put an additional set of like like from somewhere else uh, a yellow set of laces and again i think that looks really cool the red laces i've seen put in it does look good but i feel like that's quite a bit harsh for it i like the the brightness the happiness of the yellow and i probably will end up removing the uh, the color on the inner swooshes on this pair. What I also think, um, this is probably me overthinking it, but I like the fact that you've got this sort of like dark navy, almost like you're, you're working through your dark times, scratching it away to this brighter, happier mindset. Um, and that's the way I look at it. Maybe that is not why they did it, but yeah, very interesting still. Okay, so I'm just editing the video uh, and I get an email from Note Skate Shop in uh, Manchester where they are raffling off some more of the Why So Sads. And uh, weirdly enough, uh, the, my friend who actually, I got the Why So Sad uh, deck that's behind me in the rest of the other video, um, said how he really wanted a pair and missed out on getting a pair. So I messaged him quickly and was like, look, they've got your size, you want them, was able to grab them. So that is sweet as, and also, they had in their description of the shoes actually what I was just talking about. So it actually has some truth to it that John uh, put the yellow back in because it is a baseline, working towards a baseline of happiness. So all in all, that's pretty cool, isn't it? So yeah, thank you, Note. And uh, let's get back to this idiot talking about an SB Dunk. Stock white laces with yellow um, question marks on the tips and then you get these dark navy spare laces. The spare laces have a um, white uh, question mark on them and I actually think I'm gonna put the dark navy in them because I do think it looks good, but so does the white. Both both sets look really good in these. Tongue, so you've got this sort of like, almost like denim-like material in light blue, which is quite similar to the neck face tongue that we had recently and then you've got a red uh, tongue tag with yellow stitching and on the back it states why it's so sad on the heel tab is a nice red suede and then you've got that yellow question mark again really nice details on these heel tabs with the question marks and then you have the predatory birds on the outer of uh, the left and right so on the left of this pair you've got it cycling and on the on the right side you've got it skating um, Everyone, well, majority of people love uh, a little logo on the hill tab. Obviously, you think back of the pigeons, and I also really love it. So it's a really nice detail on these. All round, they're absolutely fantastic. And this um, pair has actually led me to look back at like old blueprint videos, which was probably around the time that I was actually like fully immersed into the actual skate scene. Obviously, life ended up, I ended up drifting away from that and just having to earn money and trying to survive. And it's only recently I've dived back into that world because I have been able to start purchasing shoes like Dunks, which has been really nice. And it's sometimes a distraction, sometimes like um, 
uh, a bit intense because we almost get that addictive nature when it comes to collecting shoes, I suppose. I forgot to mention, but I had said it earlier, you've got the insoles as well with the um, logos of the Predatory Bird by John Horner and then Why So Sad on the Nike SB. Again, I just want to say thank you to um, uh, John Rattray, he's doing an absolutely amazing job. He's such a good narrator, like his voice you can just listen to, it's very calm but powerful at the same time. He actually did some of the narration to explain the crushed DC skate shop when we had the Nike SB crush release and then he's also done a little um, narration over a video with Nike SB recently talking about the why so sad. So The fact that it has the word sad in it prompted John Rattray, that's me, to use it as the foundation of a campaign that attempts to demystify the subject of mental health and reduce... So you're doing an absolutely fantastic job. Um, I'm gonna leave links to anything that I've talked about in the video, obviously to the uh, Why So Sad website where you can purchase uh, the t-shirts. I haven't looked recently, they do go out of stock and then they do come back in. Uh, and if you wanna donate to any mental health charities, obviously that is uh, really cool if you can. And uh, if you can purchase a t-shirt from uh, Focus, I will leave that link down below. Obviously that is good to support a mental health charity based in Scotland as well. And you get a really cool design to go with it. So yeah, I'm gonna do, I'll do the Bruins first and then I'll do the um, Dunks and I'll do a few lace swaps, probably just the stock ones maybe. And then yeah. Thank you very much for watching. I know it's been a bit late. I've had to get my energy back up to get into the mood for filming. And uh, yeah, I had to do it for this pair because they're absolutely fantastic. Anyway, it's Woodsy out.